Okay, so, today has been a long day. What time is it? Is hell it, on <laughs> it It has been hell in Baton Rouge. I want it I is 4.30 uh, a.m. the next morning. And today started out at 8 o'clock this morning <laughs> with my husband waking me up telling me he needed help help. So what through my head, um, a lot of things went through my head, but what he needed help with was his back itched. Why did his back itch? Because the idiot at the beach the other day said he wanted color. Looks like a leprechaun because he's white as a ghost. Didn't want to put sunscreen on wanted color. So what happened? He burnt. I want to get rid of my farmer's tan. No. He burnt to a crisp, was red, had to put aloe on him like every 30 minutes, it seemed like. And this morning he decided to shower with his body wash, which had fragrance. And if anybody knows, when you have a bad sunburn, you don't shower with stuff that has fragrance because it irritates your skin even more but he decided against it for some reason he did not pay attention to what the world was telling him I need to smell smexy. don't know he needed to smell smexy for his black girlfriend at work LaQuisha LaQuisha so he comes in there itching like he had the chicken pox I had to get the calamine lotion and lather it on. It felt good. Then he leaves to go to work. At 2 o'clock I text him and said, Is it really only 2? Because it feels later this day is going to be forever long. Then our 11 month old sits in my lap around 4 and I saw bugs crawling in her head. What are bugs? Bugs. A.K.A. she has lice. <laughs> what infant gets lice? They are not daycare kids. They are not play with other kids. We live four and a half hours for many body we know. But they just got back from vacation from up north with my family. So they brought it back with him and her. Thank you so much for the gift. But no thank you. Take it back where you got it. Return it. Get your monies back. I don't care. I don't want it. So, at 4 o'clock, I text my husband, tell him that we have an infestation of lice, which I think is disgusting, even though, against what other people think, lice loves clean hair, so we are actually very clean people, but it's still disgusting to think there are little bugs crawling all around my house. I didn't get him. So, me seeing bugs in her head makes my head itch in reality. Luckily, I didn't get it, but unfortunately, our two-year-old did. So now I have an almost one-year-old and two-year-old with lice. The one-year-old is walking around screaming her head off all day, I guess, because her head itched. I don't know. <laughs> so it's driving me crazy. I'm trying to clean the house. I vacuum the couch. I vacuum the rug. I spray bug lotion on there. I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with lice in my house. So... After the two-year-old wakes up from a nap, we go to Walmart, we buy supplies. We bought um, shampoo, we bought uh, spray, we bought gel, we bought a comb, we bought Listerine because someone told me that that would smother and kill the lice. We bought shower caps by the dozen. <laughs> we come home, we put the Listerine in my hair, in the infant's hair, and in the toddler's hair. I left it in there for probably an hour, took the caps off, sprayed more Listerine in there. I did that every 30 minutes. Afterwards, while that was setting, I took all the pillows, the blankets, the stuffed animals, the carpet, the couch, the bed. I took everything apart. I was at work. And while I'm doing all this by myself, my <laughs> lovely husband was at work. I was at home with a toddler and an infant screaming their heads off yelling at me. So, let's take a journey on what my house looks like now. <laughs> so, 
besides my lovely appearance, this is my kitchen table. Yes, I have tons of pillows, blankets, clothes, towels, etc. This is my dryer. It has towels sitting on top of it that I have washed and dried to get rid of the bugs. This is my dryer. I don't know if you can see. That is one of many loads of pillows because I love decorating my bed with tons of pillows like the designer magazines that some of you see. This, however, is my washer. That is our bedding from our spare bedroom in our daughter's room. Another load that I have washed. This, however, is my bedroom. That is the pillows that I still have to put in the dryer to heat to get rid of the bugs. This is a load of various pillowcases, blankets, sheets, whatsoever that I have washed and dried. This is rugs, blankets, more pillowcases, stuffed animals, whatever else cloth in my house that I thought them stupid bugs would attach to, hatch eggs, grow, whatever. This is my bed. It is 4 o'clock, 4.30, whatever in the morning. I am tired, but I cannot sleep in my bed because it is not made because there is bug infestation in my house. <laughs> this is Febreze. It is kiwi strawberry scent. It is what I'm using to get rid of the wonderful lavishing scent of this Equate brand of bedding lice treatment spray that I've sprayed on my couch, on my rocking chair, on my bed, on my carpet, on everything else in my house because I thought it would get rid of it. This is my lice station in my kitchen. Why not included? This is my Listerine. It is Equate brand. It is what I put in these little spray bottles. Wherever. Um, they're two ounce spray bottles. It is what I heard and looked up that killed the wonderful bugs that lay in your head. This is the gel that I did not use. This is the shampoo that I did not use because I have an infant and I have a toddler and apparently you cannot put these chemicals on a toddler or infant head. Therefore, they both have an appointment at 10.30 in the morning right before my dentist appointment at 11.30 in the morning. Isn't that wonderful? I'm having an awesome week. Um, also, they have this little comb included in the kit. Does nothing. My fingertips did better than that stupid comb. So, if you have lice in your home, I advise you have a good working dryer and washer, a good vacuum, Lysol, Febreze, because that spray smells awesome. Awful, not awesome, awful. I do recommend getting the spray because it does get rid of stuff that you cannot put in your washer or dryer. We also, me and my husband were fortunate we did not get the lice. So we had this lovely shampoo that is recommended on the market. It is new. It is in the bathroom. Can you please hand me that, lo uh, that shampoo, please, darling? Please, that shampoo. Thank you. This shampoo, it is Lice Shield. It repels lice. I don't know if it works. It is new. The other alternative was slathering my head with mayonnaise as if I was a giant hot dog or hamburger, whichever I do not know. So, to end my night, while I wait for all these things to finish washing and drying, and going back to order and hopefully getting some sanity tomorrow at the doctor's office but not at the dentist's office is my lovely glass of wine 
or fifth or sixth, I don't know. This is the second bottle. It is $3 at Walmart, and it is lovely. So, my recommendation, if you get an infestation of lice in your house, have a working washer and dryer, wash things you can wash, then dry them on high heat if possible. Everything you cannot wash, dry it on high heat if possible because it kills the lice. Also, have uh, if you do not have lice, get the lice repellent shampoo or lather your hair with mayonnaise. I do not care. It is just best to keep them out of your head. You smell like gin. No. It smells like a citronella candy. Like you might be repellent to mosquitoes, which is a plus for that shampoo because it smells like a ginormous citronella candle, despite what my husband says. Also, you might want to get the spray because the spray does work well on things you cannot put in your washer or dryer. Get a vacuum, vacuum as much as possible. Um, if you have a child that will sit still long enough for you to take those bugs out of their head, take them out of their head once they are dead. Listerine does smother them. If in a bowl. You, in a bowl. You put it in a bowl. No, in their head. Spray the Listerine on your head, put the cap on, leave it on there for 30 minutes. The heat from your head, the Listerine, the alcohol, it smothers them. Then you go up there and pick them out. The eggs are hard to see, but if you do all these things, you should succeed. If not, go to the doctor and get professional help because I am not a professional and I am going crazy with these bugs in my house. I am a clean person and these bugs make me feel disgusting. But, after all that is said, don't forget, subscribe to my page, like my photos, comment if you know how to get rid of lice better than I do, or leave me suggestions and as always follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. And this is my husband with his lovely We have hair. a happy family. Despite the nasty books. But all my links and this luxurious hair. <laughs> all my links are posted on my page. Just click on them and you can follow, subscribe, or like any of the above. Have a good night, because I sure have a long one.